Okay. Research skill of at least five. What do I have? Four. What pushes that up? Intelligence and scholarship. Okay, well, I can't do anything. Wondering if I should read this right now or later. Probably should read it now. <clears throat> Gargoyles. During the medieval conflict with the... Uh... <laughs> is the Z silent or is the T? You know what? It's probably entirely silent. I don't know. The... Timothy? I don't know. Fuck it. Clan Tamir Deville developed further in, into uh, secret blood magics and created a race of protectors known as gargoyles. Since their inception, gargoyles have been used as scouts, warriors, and sentries. Fuck. I'm gonna run into a gargoyle and have to kill it. Or it's gonna kill me. Gargoyles are monsters. Vampire... Monsters, vampires, by virtue of the blood and flesh through which they are created, they are no more. I lost my spot. They are no more than the uh, detritus of uh, other clans. Given a hold on, given a second chance to serve their Tamir creators. Unfortunately, many have wrongly come to view their service as slavery and have fled their masters in search of some delusional utopia. Most, most escaped gargoyles live in isolation, preferring solitude to even the company of their own kind. Homunculi. For the most uh, menial and mindless tasks, many Tamir create what is called a hum homunculus. These are mindless creatures which take on many forms, winged, many-legged, or otherwise. Homunculi are unfailingly loyal, but their appearance makes them a serious threat to breaking the masquerade. Alright. Some of these we don't need. No, cloak. Just stop it. Wow, this place is big. Uh... Did anyone else see the glowy stuff? Sorry to bother you, Darth Vader! <laughs> Shit. Time to go, time to go, time to go. Um, I, uh, okay, that was odd. Let's go upstairs. Alright, so... 
Wait, shit. Now I'm confused. Let's see if I go this way. Maybe if we go this way. Ha! Because then we came this way. We would. We, we don't want to do that shit. Okay, um, left. It's a maze. Wonderful. Because we went that way. Yeah, shit. Yeah, we want to try. Let's try this again. We go this way. And... I mean, we can leave this place. And come back. Uh, let's see, maybe the scary vampire guy is uh, not going to kill us. Hi. Greetings, Neolate. Might I assume you received my invitation? I have been looking forward to meeting you for quite some time. Oh. Um. I don't see how any of the clues led to here, though. <laughs> yeah, I got it. I, I'm assuming you are Strauss, Maximilian Strauss. I am the regent of this chantry. Welcome. Um, what is a chantry? A chantry is a local gathering place for those of the Trumia clan. I live here as do apprentices from time to time. I am not Tremere, though. I am Nosferatu. What does that have to... Why did you send me a message? Okay, and you're a regent. What is that? A regent is the leader of a chantry, as well as a teacher to young Tremere apprentices who are studying the mysteries of our clan. Uh, can you tell me about these mysteries? I'm sorry, Neonate. The secrets of the Tremere clan are hidden from all but those who share our blood. You would do best not to look into them any further. Oh, okay. What can you tell me, Max? What's going on here downtown? Let me give you some advice, young one. Your survival in kindred society will often depend on your ability to find out yourself what is going on around you. Remember that well. <laughs> I like that. Oh, thanks, Dad. Okay, I appreciate the advice. As for what is going on here in downtown, the word on everyone's lips, kindred or kind, seems to be epidemic. Yeah, what's going on? It seems that disease has been spreading at an alarming rate throughout the downtown population. Considering our particular appetites, the local kindred are more than concerned about these developments. Who does she do? Whack. Interesting. Yes, indeed. My opinion is that the local anarchs are responsible for these outbreaks. Their precipitous indulgence of certain passions often leads to such things. Ergo, their need for the watchful eye of the Camarilla. Okay, uh, maybe I can look into this epidemic for you. Hmm. <clears throat> Interesting proposition. If you succeed in finding the cause of this epidemic and putting an end to it, I will compensate you appropriately for your efforts. <laughs> I'll do it. We'll figure out what you owe me uh, when I get back. Very well. Again, <coughs> I recommend speaking with the Anarchs. You can find most of them at the local watering hole, reveling in the vices of their former lives. I believe the place is called The Last Round. Uh, 
Tell me about the Camarilla. The Camarilla. It is merely a kindred sect that exists to protect its members from the outside world. There are specific codes of behavior that we abide by in order to ensure the continuance of our species. It is nothing more and nothing less. Yeah, there was something else. Of course. <clears throat> what is it you would like to know? Of Talk about course. something else. I'm out of here. See ya. <laughs> well, he seemed okay with me poking around his place. Now, am I still going to be uh, teleported? Yeah. Okay, so there's really only one way in and out. Talking to the uh, hazmat guys. Do you hear something? I hear something. This is where I found that knife. The Hollow Book Hotel. Get into here. No. It sounded like somebody was. Someone's voice was being muffled by something. This is where I killed that annoying uh, ghoul. This is where the punks are, yo. Came from that direction. I think. Actually, hold on. I'm gonna keep looking around. Oh shit! I'm glad he didn't see me. God damn it. Look, a Slenderman. Yay! This area is... Oh, okay, I see where I am. Yeah. Did you guys hear that? I heard a gunshot. Explore. 